Welcome back everyone to another video. Today we're going to be playing some Minecraft. Uh, it's obviously going to be like me building and stuff. It's going to be me doing like sort of base tour. I do this a couple of times in other games. But I have to show off what me and my friends will be making or what I've been making. Uh, but yeah, this is a world where me and my friends will be playing. Uh, me, Den and Fire, all three of us have been working together to make this world. That's been on five ages. I just want to give you a bit of a tour of what we've done so far. This world did corrupt once. So we did lose quite a bit of data. So we did have to rebuild the part bit. We did have, I did build a tower over there, and there was mine now here for like a little train station for like a, for like a quarry over there. We had a quarry, but we haven't bothered doing it anymore. We just we have that down there. Main reason is because of it. We, we basically got nothing from it. We hardly got anything, so it was pointless of doing the quarry. We got all the iron we got. We basically had to spend again on iron pickaxes. Because we were going through so many mine nets, so it was, yeah, it was really a bad idea, but, yeah, we've done, we've got, we're doing a strip mine now, we are. But yeah, where should I start? Um, let's just head in the building, I guess. We do the house, we do the garden, and we have the final area, well, we, yeah, still quite a bit to do, but yeah. So we have this Arctic, we're not sure what to put in here. Um, we might, uh... We were thinking of like some sort of nightclub thing or something, like a party place. Uh, yeah. Also, before, this house was a bit different, because technically, uh, before the game crafted, the house just ended here. Uh, you see, I was talking about why I, uh, why it's a bit bigger than before thing. So here's fire bedroom. Uh, obviously, this is not our main bedroom. We have a, another place where all of our main bedrooms are. But yeah. Uh, it's quite a bit big, and you have this, this, this little room back here. Uh, yeah, and if we come over here again and go to the room next door, it's basically exactly the same. I still need to get two glass to finish off this. I'm not quite sure I've done that first, but yeah, we have this little little closet for my room. I still need to move my bed downstairs. Uh, yeah, there's, that. there's my bedroom. Then we have Den's, and uh, it's still bed, yeah, very small. And then we have VMAX's bedroom. What is uh, yeah, he hasn't been on the server at all, but yeah. It's literally just this. We need to come on here with a bigger room, but yeah. Then we have a little bit of an archery range. We, we've never used this, so I, I think I might want to extend the house a bit more this way. Uh, if we need, like, a bit more room. We could still have the archery range here if we extend it this way. Or just, but maybe I have to move a bit further back. Maybe in my house, the house might come up to here. Uh, we, we do have, like, a big farm behind us and stuff. And the front, yeah, I don't really want to extend out there. So we don't really have too much areas we can extend it to. And then we have that there, I'll show you like this, we have this. So I'm just crafting under, yeah, we have a shit ton of cobblestone. Um, we have this little room here, it was supposed to be a living room. So if I go out front, this is the house. So the house used to end here, but then after the game corrupted, we had a stables here. And I wanted to redo the, st uh, we're going to redo the stables, but I thought, why not like attach the stables to the house in some way? So I decided to do this. Well, I think it looks pretty nice. I don't really know if I actually really want to extend the house up on this side much because of it might ruin the look of a house. I think the house looks pretty good. Uh, yeah. I got on with the same panels we had the stables before. Obviously, like, yeah, the wooden bricks, what's on here. I might actually put these bricks on this side. I think they do look pretty good. But yeah, you have three stables, you have a door going through them all. Not really much here. Yeah, this little underpass was pretty nice. And then if I come through here, we have this little area here where we might do as like a little uh, sort of place for the, court, for the strip mine where you might bring stuff up and put in there. A bunch of furnaces or something. We're not really going down there. There's nothing there. It's just, yeah, a couple of hallways we've on the side, yeah. I am thinking of putting like a little fortress above there, aiming out towards the ocean like how you had back in the day. Because, of, yeah, pretty nice. I think that'd be pretty nice. So if we come back in here, and we go up here, I was thinking of just doing this as one big room, but I decided to like split this up here, so these two rooms have a little like sort of little claws in the back, because I don't think we're ever really going to put much up here. This could just become a random chest room full of cobblestone and dirt if we fill up a bunch of stuff. Not that much, but room might be it for that room. Now if we go to the garden. Usually, you just do gardens. I, think, I should say here, we have like a little observatory here, whatever you call it. Uh, the thing was behind your house. What's well, usually made of glass? Ob observ 
Tommy. Can't really think the name. I'm always, I always screw names up. We have this little little pond thing here. And then here's a farm. Usually farms are just like um, like in rows. But I didn't really want to do just rows for the farm. Because I feel like people do that too much. I want to do something more unique. So I decided to go for more of something like kind of in real life. Where the farm is kind of built into the landscape. Instead of just doing it flat like you do in Minecraft. Like like in like with rice fields, like you would have like I don't know, it just go up the layers. You'd have like a layer here full of rice, and you'd go up here, there, there, stuff like that, stuff like that. Just want to make it look a bit nicer, and it does look pretty nice from up there. So we have beetroot here, we have wheat, and then we have carrots over there. We've got plenty of toffees. I also have a bit of a tree farm going on over there, uh, so that's quite nice. I'm gonna try to make this own to a forest here. Uh, so yeah, if we need wood, we go there. Uh, and then after you chop down the trees, you replant them. So we, so we have tr more trees to chop down. We also have a bit of a spruce farm there because we do need quite a bit of spruce because of uh, later on when we go in our secret place. Yeah, you do need uh, the floors or oh, all the floors of our bedrooms are made out of spruce. And then you got pens. You have a, a pig pen here. You have a cow here. You have a chicken there, and you have a sheep there. So yeah, you have all four pens. We did have animals on it before, before the corruption, but yeah, obviously thing. This fire here has been f here for ages. I, I have fire spread off. I turned it on and like it was doing nothing. So I don't know if that's like a glitch. I think it's quite cool though. <laughs> Just on fire. Yeah, I used to have a train station right here. Oh, I was building it. I might put the fortress here because you see here like the ocean. I think that's perfect because of, uh, yeah, we have our house here in this harbor. And um, we also think, like, me and Dan thought like, we, this could be some sort of fishing place. And because this is flat here, we could put, like, a little town here. So if I put, like, a little fortress sort of thing here, looking over the ocean, that would be a pretty good defense thing. Obviously, I know, like, realistically, we, we're not going to be fighting things. We're going to be fending off things. But it's just nice to make it look, like, kind of realistic. Where we'd have, like, a thing looking over here, defending against ships or something. I think that would be pretty cool. But let's head back inside. You can see from this side, like, I do like that roof quite a bit. This is the spruce farm. I am thinking of extending this, uh, maybe a round bomb of that hill, something like that. Obviously, next time I do this, I don't know how many of these I'm going to do. I might do, like, one in, like, a month's time or something. Depending on how much you play. Like, I'm not going to do, like, yeah. I might do two or three over it. Depending on how much, obviously, we do and stuff like that. So here's the farm bar. This is what this entire house is basically based on. We have a secret bunker. We are putting, we are planning on putting like a secret door here. I'm not sure really how we're gonna do it yet. I think that's also why I might expand the house a bit, just so we have the room to do so. And yeah, we could have like uh, my TV just wants to shut down. Sorry for that, guys. I don't know if I would show on the video, but yeah. If I extend this out further here, maybe somehow you could have like a little uh, basement there. And maybe from a bit of secret door we can enter into here. That could be something. We don't really have that planned yet. But yeah, we have this side here. We haven't done anything yet. This is like where the armory, we have a prison there. Uh, animals and plants for like farms. We're going to have a vault. You usually have like a, a lot of enemies spawning there. Oh, mother. Time to fight, I guess. Yeah, quite a bit do spawn down here. We have so many torches, but they still spawn down. And we have a vault back here. Well, obviously, we haven't done anything yet. I guess I could, uh... We did... Fire did start a bit on this, but yeah. Due to the corruption, we lost to that progress. Here's a storage room. This was completed, but we... Yeah. Due to the corruption, of course, again. Uh, still a bit needs to be done. Yeah. All the spruce where they basically put on this floor. We have a laboratory where we, we never really did much of. But we did have a, a, a nether portal down here. So we'll do that again. And if we go upstairs over here. We have our meeting room. Well, I'm planning to put like black wall in the back. And then have a big map here going across here. It might cost quite a lot of materials. But it should be, should be pretty cool. And have like a meeting table down here. For it. We can plan operations. Then you have the kitchen. Well, I need to get some more materials to finish this off. But it shouldn't be too bad when it's finished off. I just realized I also need to do the roof. I just realized that. 
But the roof we keep our stone, we, of course, like, I'm going to have to mine the, this bit out here to put in stones. So, but yeah, we, we like a stone roof. We did, this is the enchantment room. We did have this basically almost fully done. We just need to get books. But yeah, I, I was going to mine this out, but then was the one who mined out. So I wasn't sure the exact sort of coordinates or how he did it before. Oh, if he wants to change a bit. Then we come in here. This is Den's bedroom. In the basement. This is with their GMX bedroom be or something or somebody's. But yeah, this is Den's bedroom. He hasn't mined out yet. He hasn't since the corruption hasn't really done much. I think he's mined this out, maybe chop some trees and stuff. I don't really know what else he's done. If you come in here, to the right you have Fire's bedroom, to the left you have my bedroom. And I'm gonna extend the hallway to my side a bit more like that. Like it's there. But yeah, if you come into my bedroom, uh yeah, this is it. This is where the bed and everything will be. And I have a little armory with my diamond armor, my iron armor. Depending on how I do. Actually, this is my first set of iron armor I had in the service. It's basically almost broken. And this is my diamond armor if we ever need to fight something. Thing. Uh, so if we come here, this is my little storage room. Nothing much in here. Uh, little crafting area, stuff like that. I'm going to put like a TV or something here. Like a map. I had a map in this one. I'm going to put that back. So that shouldn't take too long to do. And we have this little hallway between my fire's room. And this is his room. So you have a little chest room here. Uh, yeah, it's quite nice. He still has to do a bit more of the ceiling. But that shouldn't be take too long. There's this little door here now. I don't think he had this door before. And he has his bedroom. It's nice. Before this wall was further that way. This bit here was a bit bigger. Well, I think it was a bit nicer. Because if, if there's not really much room here to do much. If he's gonna put like a living room here or something. I think it was like two more this way. I think it was like the wall was here or something or here. I think it was here. Yeah, I think it was here. It made it a bit bigger so we could have a bit more of a living room. But yeah, I guess me and Fire haven't really done much with our rooms. But then he did do quite a lot. He had really, uh, yeah, he had built a house. Like he had mined this away and built a house in this room. So he had done quite a bit. But let's head back up to uh, the roof so we can just look over so we can finish off there. I think that's quite nice. But yeah, I think uh, we've done a lot. It's also night time now. Anyways, it's still spawn inside here, but they haven't really spawned inside the actual house itself for quite a bit. So that's nice. They haven't even spawned on the roof, I'm surprised about. I'm not sure why. But yeah, I think it's quite nice. The server, you see all the light, all the torches and stuff. Pretty nice. But yeah, if you did enjoy this film, please like and subscribe. I will do another video on this uh, server in the future when we, uh, yeah, when we do more. We are, there's a lot more we are planning on doing. Uh, we want to defeat the enemy dragon all that sort of stuff, so that should be fun. But yeah, I guess that's it for today. So yeah, if you didn't see so yeah, it, I don't know, if I'm going to be saying it again. As always, that's one part of the videos I always think is the end part. I always just say the same thing over and over again. But if you did enjoy this, please like, subscribe, and comment. And yeah, I'll see you all next time. So, cheerios!